You're watching www.thepopperty.com. We are here in the beautiful stadium, SCG Mon Thong in Bangkok, Thailand. And I have the coach of Sri Lankan Sevens Rugby, Matt Turner, is with me. Sri Lanka could not finish third once again, but they finished uh, fourth uh, as uh, uh, like in uh, China. Matt, what went wrong and what went right? Um, we'll start off with the negatives. We, we gave the ball away too much. Um, we city offloads, uh, basic errors that we made, passing, all, those, all the small things that can be fixed. Um, in the earlier games, in our semi-final, we, we went off page, which led us to be out of shape and ended us losing that game. Positives, it's, it's areas that we can fix within a week, um, which is good. It's not sort of long-term changes. We've just got to get our, our mental side of the game right and go into, the same, into every game with the same mental approach. When you talk about positive, uh, Sri Lanka lost to China in the first leg in the semi-finals. So they beat China in a very interesting clash here. Yeah, I mean, we, to be honest, we probably shouldn't have lost that, the first one in China. Um, we've got to give them credit for beating us there. Um, but it shows that we, we can win the harder games. But we've just got to be mentally prepared and, and willing to put our bodies on the line, which we weren't for the last two. And your thoughts about not scoring a single try against Korea? Uh, obviously, it's it's a uh, tale of disappointing. You know, more for the boys than me. Um, Korea defended well, so I mean, they they will be looking at that as a zero. Um, but we, we we should be scoring more tries. We 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 need to keep the ball alive. We need to go use what we've got. We've got all the, the ability to score tries. So there's no reason why that we should ever have a zero on our side of the score sheet. Well, Matt, the final leg is going to be held in Colombo, 10th and 11th October at the Race Course International Ground. We struggled to beat Hong Kong uh, twice in this leg and once in the China leg. Uh, what sort of input are you going to put that? We've just got to correct the, uh, the small errors we're making, keep hold of the ball and don't jump away from our game plan against a team like Hong Kong. They, they're very structured in the first phase, but if we keep the ball and move them left, right, they're big, big boys, so we've got to move them around. And we can't afford to give them easy ball because, you know, they've got a lot of experience in their side and they will capitalize on those errors. And that's what they do against us. We do all the hard work. And then finally, when we're one phase or two phases away from scoring, we turn it over and they run the length. All right, Matt. Finally, how is your rotation of the players going? There are 16 in the squad and there's two more to get a debut. Rochan and Hetiarachi, are they going to come into the scene? Uh, it, it, we'll see over the, the next week or so. We... Um, I've tested out different players in this tournament. It's always been my, my plan to rotate the squad a bit for the first two and then go into Colombo with a full strength team. Um, there will be changes for Colombo, I can tell you that now. Um, but we've got to keep the team a bit of consistency within the squad. And I think we're nearly there with the full strength squad. Thank you very much for talking to us. So that is Matt Turner and we are here signing off from SCG Mohan Thong Stadium in Bangkok on the Asian 7 second leg with courtesy of Intrust Group and I'm Sabir Kader sharing the passion.